Last couple of weeks have been great for those who love bigger screens and powerful performance, since Apple just unveiled their mid-budget tablet, the iPad Air 5 with high-end features. And it has got some mind-blowing upgrades that put many other remaining tablets questionable if they are worth buying. As we speak, even Apple's most powerful iPad Pro has got the same silicon chipset as the iPad Air 5. So instead of comparing two iPads, in today's video, we decided to compare the new iPad Air 5 with Samsung's most powerful Galaxy Tab S8, which almost has a similar display size and price tag. So without further ado, let's jump in. The design of the iPad Air 5 hasn't been changed compared to its predecessor as it looks pretty sleek and feels quite ergonomic on hands. The screen also appears to be the same as its previous model, having a 10.9-inch IPS display, but we expected to see an OLED panel this time. However, the Galaxy Tab S8 features a slightly bigger 11-inch display, nestled in a metallic frame. Besides, it feels pretty premium and lightweight to be able to use in one hand. On top of that, you get the privilege to scroll at a 120Hz refresh rate with the Tab S8, whereas the iPad Air 5 still sticks to the 60Hz refresh rate. So that's one plus for the Galaxy Tab S8. Next comes the camera section. Though this isn't a major priority while choosing a tablet, the camera needs to be good enough to capture still images or have FaceTime calls. Keeping that in mind, Apple has updated the front camera with a 12MP ultra-wide lens, whereas you'll find a 12MP main sensor for the rear camera. On the contrary, the Galaxy Tab S8 surely steals this point as well having a dual camera lens for the rear option consisting of a 13MP main sensor and a 6MP ultra-wide lens. And the front camera gets the upgrade with a 12MP ultra-wide lens. Besides, both the iPad Air and Galaxy Tab S8 support center stage feature, so video calling while being in groups shouldn't be an issue anymore. Now let's talk about the performance, which surely is a crucial part as tablets are mostly used for multitasking. The latest iPad Air is powered by Apple's M1 processor that is capable of delivering excellent performance whether it's heavy editing, gaming, or multitasking. The iPad Air 5 can handle them all quite smoothly. But you won't be disappointed with the Galaxy Tab S8 either, as it comes with the latest Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 chipset. With the Tab S8, you can immerse yourself in heavy gaming, and the user interface is well optimized for multitasking. But if you compare the two chipsets side by side, the M1 performs much better than the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1. From the Geekbench 5.2 score, the M1 chipset outperforms the 8 Gen 1 both in single-core and multi-core score. Certainly, performance belongs to the iPad Air 5. But the Galaxy Tab S8 offers some added advantages with its stylus, which can significantly extend your overall productivity. And the best part is, the stylus comes with the tab itself, whereas for the iPad Air, you need to buy the Apple Pencil tube externally. This will certainly cost you some extra bucks. Nevertheless, to keep your work going, both tablets offer up to 10 hours of battery life, but the Tab S8 supports up to 45 watts of fast charging, which will let you juice up your tablet faster than the iPad Air 5. So considering the price and overall features, the Galaxy Tab S8 seems to be more suitable if you want added advantage of the stylus, better camera quality, and fast charging. But if you want your tablet to be extremely powerful that can handle heavy-duty tasks, the iPad Air 5 is what you should go for. Which one would you want to buy? We would love to hear from you. Please let us know and as always, thanks for watching our video. Like, comment and share with your friends if you find this video helpful. Subscribe to our channel if you want more videos like this on your feed.